Hello, everybody. I'm Davey Stalo. Welcome to day 25 of albums that are celebrating their 45th birthday, anniversary, whatever, in 2023. We're celebrating 1978 and the coming of spring. And I tell you one thing, it didn't look like spring today here in northern Utah. Uh, hopefully by the time you see this on Saturday morning, this is, I'm doing this on Friday night, of course, it'll be better weather here in U northern Utah, but all day Saturday it snowed here in northern Utah. Now I'm telling everybody, I don't know how much longer I can take this spring-like weather. I mean, it just won't stop. <laughs> I guess it's a good thing in a way. It means we're going to have plenty of snow in the mountains. Plenty of water this year. But I hate when it teases with these little warm periods. Like last week, it was basically warm into the weekend. Saturday, last Saturday was pretty great. Pretty good. Got me doing things, you know. Got me moving things into the air and stuff, but then boom, here comes winter right back. But anyway, what can you do? So anyway, today we're doing pick 25, of course it's the 25th, duh. Today's album comes from a band that started in... Uh, Actually, it started out in the 1960s, but in my right screen here. Don't you love it when you're in the wrong screen? Okay. Actually, yeah, it started out in the 1960s, but of course on different names. One was Fuse. Uh... The other one was uh, Sick Man of Europe. Ultimately, they chose a name called, uh, known as Cheap Trick. In 1973. And, of course, the album that we're going to talk, we was, uh, talk, yeah, talk to, we're going to talk to this album, is a live album. The very first album I bought from this band, from Cheap Trick, and that's, of course, at Budokan. This is the original album I bought back in 19, I believe, 19, either, either late 1978 or some early 1979. Still in pretty good shape, isn't it? baby up here. Got a lot of pictures inside. Oop. But I played the heck out of this album. Of course a lot of my friends say, Ooh, you like cheap trick? Ew, what do you? You know, it it's funny. Uh how a band can become popular, but among certain crowds or certain people, it's not clue, it's not cool to like them. And Cheap Trick, in my group of friends, was not cool to like. But I didn't care. I listened to them. And this album, like I said, I played the heck out of it. Uh, original li original lineup. Robin Zander, lead vocals, rhythm guitar, Rick Nelson on lead guitar, backing vocals, Tom Peterson, Peter Son on bass and backing vocals, and then Bunny Carlos on drums. And I never knew this for years, but his real name is Brad M. Carlson. <laughs> for some reason, the name Bunny Carlos I don't know. It just bugs the heck out of me, but that's what he chose to be called, so 
Hey, who am I to argue? But this album was just, it was just fantastic, and it should have been a, a a double album. But of course, you're dealing with uh, record execs and uh, the record company, and they're going to say, "No, we're putting out what we want you to put out." Starts out with, "Hello there." Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Are you ready to rock? And goes into, come on, come on. Look out. Big eyes. Got those big eyes. Do, 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 do. Big eyes. Uh, I Need Your Love. One of my favorites. Uh, of course, all these songs are, my, are great. Ain't that a shame? Ain't that a shame? You're the one to blame. <laughs> uh, of course, I want you to want me. You know, that song I, I still love. Uh, it's one of those songs that I haven't really got tired of it. I don't listen to it as much as I used to, but I'm not sick of it. Let's put it that way. Uh, surrender. Good night or, or good night now and clock strikes ten. Clock strikes ten. It's a Saturday night, <laughs> but just loaded with great tunes. And what is really nice is they ultimately released the entire concert on the two uh, disc. Uh, CD, I believe. Let's see. They did the DVD as well. On there is starts out with "Hello there," and go "Come on, come on," "Hello kitties," uh, "Speak now and forever or forever hold your peace," "Big guys look out," "Downed," uh, "From in color or." in color yeah uh can't hold on love that one i remember the first time i heard can't hold on it was on the little uh, disc uh found all the parts about that and i played the heck out of that one too uh i think they had also uh oh uh, the beatles tune uh ooh. Can't think of it now. <laughs> oh well. Uh I'll think of it eventually. Uh oh uh, can't hold on. Oh Caroline's great surrender. Uh this what a uh, song that I cannot pronounce. Oh, off one Wonderstand Off Wondershin, I guess that's how you pronounce it. I think that's off their First album, I Need Your Love, this two starts with I Need Your Love, High Roller, Southern Girls, I Want You to watch, Want Me, California Man, Good Night, Ain't That a Shame. Now, oddly enough, Ain't That a Shame is uh, the, well, oh, I'm having a hard time thinking <laughs> that. It's been a long day. Uh, what's the word I'm thinking of? I know you. I know you're probably all all telling me right now what it is. But any ain't that shame, ain't that shame and then clock strikes ten ends the concert. Uh, basically the same track listing on the DVD. Let's see, down Carolina. Which I have not yet. I, I've yet to see. I'd like to see it. Um, is that the track? Concert track listing. Hmm. But anyway, if you've never heard at Budokan, encores. Now remember the two encores. This ain't that ain't uh, ain't that a shame? God, I'll get it out. 
was originally Encore, but in the original release, it was the first track of the uh, side two. So, I don't know. <laughs> but if you've never heard this album, check it out. It's worth a listen. Um, but yeah, it's one of those great albums, great live albums. It'll go, well, it'll remain with me as one of my top, at least top 100. So check it out. And anyway, we only got, we got less than a week to go. Uh, month Lettons next, next Friday. So we'll be going all the way up to the 31st with this 45 day or yeah, 45 days, 45 years old. Um, hope you have you have a good weekend, and we will see you on day 26. Oh, and uh, I don't know if there's a, I'm going to have a rankings video. Like I said before, I think I'm going to do it every other week until I get things straightened out. This this room is still kind of a mess. I still gotta put things where they. I just I still or put things where they belong. I need to adjust some things. But come home after work, and do you think I can do anything instead of other than just sit and watch TV or something? No. But anyway, we'll talk. We'll see you on day twenty-six. Have a good one.